While grown-ups made speeches, kids did what kids do best these days. It's the reason Washington High School set up an IT fair to attract dozens of middle schoolers eager to see what new technological magic is coming their way. What they may not realize is their future job could be right under their mouse. The things that you're learning now, using your iPod, being able to use the computer, um, the games that you play, those things, those are skills that can be applied in your career as well. Michael Oakes from the Stratagen Company helped coordinate the Information Technology Fair. He's trying to help schools open the eyes of kids to the future of technology, a future that could pay them big bucks. To make the bridge between what I'm doing in school and how that's going to help me get into a career. Kiara Martin is a sophomore at Washington, a school known citywide for teaching information technology. She's not decided whether this will be her career, but she sure knew her stuff as she took us on a tour of the fair. Over here we made our bridges on the computer before we actually put them together. Then over here we have, we have our simple machines that are programmed by the computers. And this wasn't just for the students. It turns out teachers and counselors need as much education on IT as the students, maybe more. That's a big challenge because a lot of times kids are moving faster than the teachers are. Technology is exploding, and even though middle schoolers do know their digital devices, they have to know that IT can help them get a job. Joanne Williams, Fox 6 News.